Hey guys, it's Dr. Matt. I wanted to go over how to use this proper pillow. This is what we recommend our patients use to sleep um, at home. First thing to know is when you sleep, the optimal position is gonna be laying on your back. A pillow like this also has a little hole in it, which is gonna help support that curve in the neck. And then also, if you move to your side, that's okay, as long as you're making up that distance between the ear and the shoulder. You don't want your head to be too tilted in one position. Um, no sleeping on the belly, that's very bad for your neck. It's also not great for your low back. All right, let me show you what's going on with this pillow. Inside, when you open it up, it looks just like a normal pillow, but right in the middle here, there's a little hole cut out. So there's a ridge down below and above. You'll lay on your back with your head falling slightly into that hole and your neck will be supported by this ridge. One side is thicker than the other, so if you feel like it's too thick or too thin, just flip it over. If you move to your side from about here to here, there's no hole, it's nice and thick, so it's gonna support your neck from the side. So when you move to your side, just stay towards the edges of the pillow and it'll make up that distance for you. And again, one side is thicker than the other, so you can flip it over if you feel like you need some more support. You'll also find inside the case, there is a little quarter inch foam pad. And what you can do, this is for if you feel like you need a little more thickness on the pillow, you can unzip this pillowcase and you can stick that quarter inch foam underneath the pillow when you sleep to add more distance. Good thing about this pillow, you can also unzip this and you can actually wash it, which is really cool. And uh, one thing also to know, when you first get on it to use it, you may feel amazing right away. You may love it at the beginning, or it may take anywhere from a couple nights to a few weeks to really get used to it. The idea is you're just training your body to become a back sleeper to help with that curve in the neck. Um, back and side is okay, but you always want you to start out on your back and then if you do end up moving to the side, that's all right, but try to start out on your back every night.